Welcome to Infigyan friends. In today's video, we are having one very interesting question on radical equations. It is fifth root of 8 plus square root x plus fifth root of 8 minus square root x equal to fifth root of 16. And we have to find out real solutions only. So let's get started with our algebraic manipulation step. I will multiply RHS with fifth root of 2 in the numerator so I will multiply in the denominator by the same. Now from RHS numerator I can write this is fifth root of 16 times 2 so 32 divided by fifth root of 2. Now I can write our RHS as fifth root of 32 is 2 power 5 divided by fifth root of 2. Now I can cancel power 5 with fifth root. So it will become 2 over fifth root of 2. Let me write our equation once. So it is fifth root of 8 plus square root x plus fifth root of 8 minus square root x equal to 2 over fifth root of 2. Now let's multiply both sides with the denominator fifth root of 2. So I will write here fifth root of 2. So I need to multiply in LHS also fifth root of 2. So right hand side I will cancel these two. So RHS is 2. LHS. It is fifth root of 2, fifth root of 8 plus square root x. So I can write fifth root of 16 plus 2 square root x plus fifth root of 16 minus 2 square root x. I can take this 2 into the square root also. So I can write this equation as fifth root of 16 plus square root 4x plus fifth root of 16 minus square root 4x and RHS is 2. Now I will use substitution. Let's rewrite this equation once. So I will be writing here. Let's use substitution now. So first radicand term I will consider as a power 5 and this radicand I will consider b power 5. So I can write here fifth root of a power 5 plus fifth root of b power 5 equal to 2. Fifth root and power 5 fifth root and power 5 we can cancel we'll have our first equation a plus b equal to 2 let me call equation number 1 now i will write here a power 5 was 16 plus square root 4x b power 5 is 16 minus square root 4x if i will add both then I will get a power 5 plus b power 5 equal to 32. And this equation I will call equation number 2. Now we have to solve. I will write here equations and then I will consider equation number 1. So let me write here a power 5 plus b power 5 equal to 32 and a plus b equal to 2. Now I will consider this equation first and I will take a square and cube of this equation. So let me write here squaring a plus b whole square. It is 2 square and here I will consider cubing a plus b whole cube equal to 2 cube. Let's apply 
algebraic formulas a plus b whole square i will write a square plus b square plus twice ab equal to 4 let's consider ab equal to t so i can write from here a square plus b square plus 2t equal to 4 so a square plus b square value will be 4 minus 2t now come to this cube side i will write the identity a cube plus b cube plus 3ab in bracket a plus b right hand side is 2 cube 8 now ab is t a plus b is 2 let's put a cube plus b cube plus 3t bracket will be 2 right hand side is 8 so i can write a cube plus b cube value will be 8 minus 60 now you can see a square plus b square is available a cube plus b cube is available now known equation is a power 5 plus b power 5 equal to 32 let's take the product of these two this one with this one let's multiply so i will be writing here a square plus b square times a cube plus b cube this value will be equal to 4 minus 2t and then I will be writing 8 minus 60. Let's multiply LHS first. So I can multiply A square with A cube. So I will be having A power 5. B square with B cube. I will be having B power 5. Now cross products. A square B cube. And A cube B square. Right hand side it would be 4 minus 2t times 8 minus 60. So here I will be writing 32 as our first equation. This is 32. And here I will take a square b square common. So I will be writing 32 plus a square b square in bracket it would be b plus a or a plus b equal to let's multiply. 32 minus 24 minus 16 minus 40t plus 12t square and this value is 2 and this is t square so let me write here 32 plus 2t square equal to 32 minus 40t plus 12t square now I can cancel 32 with 32. Take all the term to RHS. So I can write equation will become 10t square minus 40t equal to 0. Take 10t common. So in bracket I will be writing t minus 4 equal to 0. Conclusion is either t will be 0 or t minus 4 will be 0. So I will write either t will be 0 or t minus 4 will be 0. So from here t is straight away 0 and here t will be 4. Now t was our substitution. This was ab. So I can write ab equal to 0. From here ab equal to 4. Now we have a plus b equation. So I can frame two easy system of equation. I will write a plus b equal to 2, a b equal to 0, one system. And here a plus b equal to 2, a b equal to 4. So from first equation, if I will write here 
one quadratic whose roots are a and b then this is sum of roots this is product of roots i can write one quadratic equation a square minus sum of roots times a plus product of roots so on this analogy i will write a square minus 2a plus 0 equal to 0 a times a minus 2 equal to 0 so a equal to 0 or a equal to 2 from this system second system sum of roots product of roots i can frame one quadratic equation a square minus 2a plus product of roots 4 equal to 0 let's check discriminant itself it is minus 2 square is 4 minus 4ac so 16 because of this is minus 12 which is negative number so it will generate complex solutions so we will reject so accepted solution is a equal to 0 a equal to 2 now we know that a power 5 value so i will write here our a power 5 was 16 plus square root 4x so from here i can write a power 5 it will be 0 power 5 0 2 power 5 is 32. So once it is 0, I will write here when a power 5 is 0, then 16 plus square root 4x equal to 0. So square root 4x will be equal to negative 16. Square root is negative. Complex solutions will generate. So we can reject this one. So last point is it is 32. So let me write here a power 5 equal to 32. So I will be writing here 16 plus square root 4x equal to 32. A square root 4x is equal to 16. Consider squaring both sides. 4x is equal to 256 so x is coming out 64 which is only real solution for this system for this systems equation system of 1 or system of equation 2 so let us consider this verification part also so i will be writing here check x equal to 64 Okay, I will be writing here fifth root of 8 plus square root of 64 plus fifth root of 8 minus square root of 64. Again, I can write fifth root of 8 plus 8. Here I can write fifth root of 8 minus 8. So this is fifth root of 16 and this is fifth root of 0. So our answer is coming out fifth root of 16 which is our RHS. Hence this value is true and verified. And this brings the end of this video. Thank you friends for watching. Do not forget to like, share and subscribe. Bye bye till next video. Good luck. Take care of yourself. Bye bye.